Tony D and Little Joan in the background, and this is a screenwriter's rant on Runt, a dog movie about a dog and a little girl who do nice things. Smash like and subscribe. Thank you for smash liking and subscribing. Check out my books. The links are in the description. Comedy Heart in South Jersey. It's a the Pineys books 1 through 14. Available at Amazon.com. Don't forget, Kindle Unlimited is free. Uh, book 15 dropping in a few weeks. Now, uh, this is very much a, a children's book come to life. It takes place in Australia. And it's about a little girl who befriends a, a stray dog and makes her her, uh, her dog. And then her family's about to lose their farm. So they enter a dog show to try to win the money to save the farm. And of course, you have all these very cartoony adults who uh, try to foil her uh, dog show. You got her dad. I mean, it's just a very wholesome story where the little girl trains the dog because they're such great friends. And uh, in the end, you know they're going to win. They go to London for the dog show, and they're going to save the farm. Uh, it's so cute. Such a cute uh, movie. I don't know any of the... Uh, yeah, I don't know any of the uh, cast, but uh, this guy in the in the glitter here on the right, he's, the, he's one of the villains. He's like the dog show villain. The dog pees on his foot. So that's the, you know, that's the level of... Uh, kid stuff so it's very wholesome and wacky september 19th see if i can find the there it is september 19th uh who wrote this thing craig sylvie wrote it and john sheedy directed it um and this is with the australian children's television foundation so again very safe stuff for your kids um yeah, I don't recognize any of the cast, but it looks it looks very nice. I like movies about dogs. Um, would I see this? Probably not. It's a little too, you know, it's for kids. But uh, if I got stuck watching it, I don't think I'd mind. You know, I, I, I think, you know, for parents, it'll be pretty wholesome. And uh, the dog will do some fun things, I'm sure. He'll, you know, he, they have sort of like a hi-fi thing, high-five thing going on, her, him and the little girl. And uh, it's a cute dog. There are other dogs in it, too. So where can you go wrong? So first act, uh, the little girl meets Runt, the Runt, and uh, they become friends, and so she adopts him. All right? And they become the best friends ever. And it's so cute. And then, but the family is on the verge of losing their farm. And so uh, they don't know what to do. And the little girl's got a lot of gumption. And she hears about the dog contest in London. So then she has to win probably a local contest in Australia to qualify for the finals in London. Of course, her and Runt do that. And they're off to London. And they somehow take the last of their money and her and her dad and that dog go to London. So they get to London, and of course, uh, evil forces are uh, trying to stop them. A dog show guy and the judge and whatever. But Runt is such a great dog, he overcomes it all, and the little girl overcomes it all. There's probably a moment in there where the father says something like, you know, even if we lose the farm, you did so much kind of thing. And, uh, but in the end, obviously it's a kid's movie. They, they will overcome it all and they will win the prize and save the farm. And that's nice. That's a nice message. It's nice and wholesome. Uh, you know, you can't fault it. So this is dropping in September. Uh, kind of a weird time, kind of a weird time to drop because the kids are going back to school, but maybe you catch it right before they go back to school. No, they'll be in school. When do they go back to school? Definitely in September. Yeah, after Labor Day. I, I, I would have opened this like Labor Day, like last 
last movie to take the kids to before school starts. But it is coming out in Australia, so it may not make it to the States until later. Might maybe around November, Christmas, which would also be a good time to go see it too. Um, let's read the write up. Runt, based on Craig Sylvie's best selling novel. Oh, he wrote the uh, screenplay, so that, that's going to be good. Is a delightful Australian family film that blends heartfelt moments with humor. The story revolves around 11-year-old Annie Shearer and her best friend Runt, an adopted stray dog. So the novel Runt was released in 2022. Wow, and they already made a movie. It achieved significant acclaim, winning several major Australian literary awards. These accolades include Children Books Councils of Australia Book of the Year for Young Readers, Book of the Year for Younger Children, at the Australia Book Industry Awards and the overall Book of the Year at the Australian Indie Book Awards. The success of the book underscores its broad appeal and the re re resonance of its themes with readers. Hmm. That's kind of an impressive write-up. A lot of these write-ups, you read them and you go, is this, is this the best you could do? <laughs> but this one, this is like impressive. I, I feel like the book has a lot of credentials. Now, it is a children's book, so they're hyping it up a little bit, but that's good. It's a solid write-up. Like, there's a, there's a lot here, it seems. Um, so, yeah, and you have the author who basically wrote the screenplay, at least he's credited, and um, that's good, too, because you're going to get his vision in the movie. So, hmm, well, you may have won me over on this. I mean, if... You know, for me, it'll probably come to streaming at some point. So, you know, this would be a good movie, I think, to see if you're a little down in the dumps, even if you're a grown-up, kind of watch it and feel good about yourself. Because you know it's going to have just the happiest ending ever. And it's going to be like, oh, yeah, yeah, doggy, go. <laughs> you know, as, a, as opposed to all these depressing horror movies where everybody dies. Um, so, yeah. So uh, mix it up a little. This this is your palate cleanser here. If uh, if you've been watching too many horror movies. It's called Runt. Look for it in September. And that's it for me, Tony D. And Little Jones somewhere in the house. Uh, check us out on the other video platforms. Which I can't mention on YouTube. Uh, but you, uh, uh, you know, one's green. One has a green thing. One has a uh, like an orange look, and the other has like a black sort of look, kind of like this, but different. And uh, you know their names; the links are below. Um, and uh, I will be in Marlton at two thirty, at um, I believe it's uh, what is it, Brightview? I think it's Brightview in Marlton. Yeah, Brightview Green Tree Senior Living at two thirty for my talk on how to hunt the Jersey Devil. Again, that one's residents and family um you'd have to call but uh, if you want to come to a public one tonight uh this is a really good one the pick a lily in it's out in shemung on 206 and they have the best wings ever and i will be doing the talk on how to hunt the jersey devil two talks today hope to see you there we'll see you in the next one